Welcome back to Nikki's Scrapbooking Adventures. Today we are celebrating Ginger's Corner for reaching 2,000 subscribers. Congratulations, Ginger. You've always been an inspiration. If you haven't already, go ahead and check out her YouTube channel. She's having a massive giveaway. I mean, I cannot believe it. And there's an international portion of it too, I believe. Well, to celebrate Ginger, we are going to be using a the color red and the word joy because she says that the scrapbooking community brings her so much joy. Well, when I think of joy, I think of the song, I've got joy down, down, down in my heart. It's an old camp song and I am going to be playing off that today. I'm also going to be playing with Let's Go Anywhere by Echo Park, which has predominantly black, white, red and brown. So this is the solo brown piece of paper and it is an absolute gorgeous wood grain. And I actually created my own cut file off my silhouette and it's using the word joy. Now my plan is to do something like this where I've used my silhouette to print and then cut this out and then I use the negatives to cut out the arrows pointing toward my photo. My boy is my joy. So I thought it'd be a perfect opportunity to go ahead and look at my leftover photos. And so this is what I'm down to for my choices. I've got this one where he is super smiley and I can fit that right in there. Super cute. I've got this one where it's just me and him looking at the Christmas lights last year. Kind of a posed picture. Very cute. Definitely has that red. And then I've got the this one. Where this is the last day of his NICU journey. And he is holding both mom and dad's hands. And I think this is going to be the one. I'm not. Let me see. So these are all leftover photos, which means that I've scrapbooked them before. Oh, look at that cute little face. Hmm. But then he's holding our hands. And he's a little itty bitty baby. And when am I ever going to be able to use this one again? I don't know. Oh, I wish I could pick both. Okay, I think I'm going to go with this one. But isn't he just stinking cute? What I'm going to do is I'm going to take the cutout from this. And I'm going to make sure that you can see both of our fingers. Holding his hand. Let's see, make sure we get his pinky in there. And then what I can do now that I have this right where I want it. I'm going to note the date on the back, as I always do, and just cut around, giving a little bit of a margin so that it can adhere to the white portion of my O. Super simple. Super, super simple to do it this way. Now, some people do extremely intricate die cuts or cut files. That is not my intent with this one. This is truly just to get the word joy and to talk about how much JJ has brought joy to our lives. Now, because I am doing this cut file, usually when I'm doing something more intense, I go ahead and do some very simple embellishing. So what I've got here to my left is some hearts that I die cut out. Now I've got a cascading heart die set and I thought this would be a perfect opportunity to just go ahead and really emphasize the hearts on my page. So upper left hand corner is going to look like that. Lower right hand corner is going to look like this. And we're just going to play off 
all of the little hearts that I made and we're just going to do a diagonal design here. Look at how simple that is. Boom. I might scoot things down just a smidge more. Let's do that like right on that line. We'll scoot this down just a smidge. And there's that. So simple. The only thing that I really want to add is some word stickers. So Tim Holtz has these chit chat words. Let's see what else I've got here. I've got this sticker book by, but I really want to keep, keep with that black and white theme. So if this doesn't have black and white, then I'm going to pass on it, right? Because I keep all of my sticker books like this in a little drawer right in front of me. And then I can just pull them out when I need them. Okay, so here's this one. That's small talk. Glad it's not snarky. Because I do have that version too, is the snarky. Okay, you've got metallic... That'd be kind of fun. Let's see. Oh, here's XOXO. Now, I kind of want to just stick... Well, it'd be kind of fun. Okay, so we'll look through that one. Let's see what else I got here. Okay. I've got a Park Lane sticker book, too. But these are more... Uh, planner phrases very cute beautiful exercise meeting errands bleh, bleh, bleh. and then there's also this book here sometimes the most productive thing you can do is relax everything will come exactly as it goes have faith it will be a cup of tea solves everything yeah this is not these are like inspirational quotes what is this Studio light, mindful art is mindful art. Yeah, that's not what I'm looking for. Okay, so it's between the metallic sticker book and the small talk. And I just want to add a couple phrases to each of those hearts. I'm happiest when I'm with you. I think that would be cute. Okay. You make my heart smile. My favorite part. And then this is the good stuff. Super sappy, but super cute at the same time. So what I'll do is I will just adhere everything down. And then I've got a couple of these black and red hearts that I punched out and I think it'd be kind of fun to scatter these around I want to make sure that each of these is facing all the same direction I think that gives some continuity to the design There we go. Let's add a black one or a red one. Let's see. Let's put one here. And I just want to kind of scatter these so it makes it more look diagonal. 
because right now I don't feel like it's very diagonal in the design and that's the Im intent that it will be diagonal I need a black one up there there so they just kind of scatter and make it more of a big picture here the question is do I frame this and what color do I frame this in so right now I'm in all my embellishments are black the hearts I'm sorry the word joy is in white do I frame this in black do I frame it at all I don't think I can do white could I do both could I do white and black uh oh no don't do it Oh, I like that. Do I do red as well? Hang on. Okay, I think I'm going to mat it. So, look for close-ups at the end of this video. Don't forget to go ahead and check out Ginger in the playlist below. They will link everything you need to know about what's going on today to celebrate Ginger. Don't forget that she does have a massive giveaway. So make sure you go ahead and like, comment, and subscribe on this video. I am trying to get to 750 subscribers. I hope you have a wonderful day, and I will see you next time.